That's right, John. So Boeing pleaded guilty and accepted that plea deal. So this means they don't have to go to trial. The Department of Justice just announced this news overnight. That deal from the DOJ was if Boeing pled guilty to felony charges of conspiracy to defraud and agreed to supervision by an outside monitor for three years, they wouldn't have to go to a criminal trial, which some lawyers say would have aired out all of their dirty laundry allegations of negligence and misconduct. This fraud charge stems from two separate 737 MAX jetliner crashes from 2018 and 2019 that in total killed 346 people. After those crashes, Boeing had come to a settlement with the DOJ to avoid prosecution, but recent safety hazards, including that door plug blowout over Oregon in January of this year, breached that deal. So this new plea deal calls for Boeing to pay an additional $243 million in fines. That is the amount that they have already paid before. They also have to invest at least $455 million in compliance and safety programs. It, of course, all is not official just yet. It still needs to get the approval of a federal judge, but already several lawyers representing some of the relatives of those cra of those victims who died in the crash are coming out online this morning saying they are going to ask the judge to reject that agreement. And another note, this deal only covers, covers the wrongdoing of Boeing from those 737 MAX jet crashes. It doesn't cover any other incidents or provide immunity for anything that we've seen happen in more recent days. For now, reporting live in Renton, I'm Taylor Winkle, Fox 13 News.